Okay, Marcy Berger at Gelt Financial. I want to do a day in the life of a really eight hours in the life of Marcy Berger at Gelt Financial. Tell our wonderful fans on TikTok and YouTube, wherever they are, some of the deals you're working on and some of the stuff you do in a day in the life of. I really, every day is an adventure here because every day is different. And I've been working on a lot of different deals. They all have their own story. I'm working on one deal that um, a person is looking to buy something in Ohio and it's a piece of property in a lot and we're looking at that as um, taking a first position on that and it's a purchase, a lot of purchases. I'm working on a very rushed deal that they came to us and they had to close within five business days and they had a whole package and that deal's in Florida and I'm working on that. Did the lender drop the ball on that or was it a foreclosure? Yes, the lender did drop the ball. A lot of times, um, you know, the brokers come to me with that situation because they, the, the borrower comes to them like, oh, I went to this mortgage broker, you know, this mortgage broker, they're working on my deal. And then the mortgage broker keeps saying that they took the deal somewhere else. And this particular borrower went to a different broker because the other broker dropped the ball and really never presented the, the package to a lender. So they just kept yesing the borrower and then the borrower was in a situation with a closing date and had no loan. Marcy, so, yeah, yeah, I, I didn't mean to interrupt. It seems to me that a lot of the deals we do are where lenders are dropping the ball, they yes. promise to approve the deal, and they yes. take upfront fees and they don't, or yes. the brokers are dropping the ball. Right, which is really important. I mean, I guess this is kind of a shout out to borrowers and brokers because as a borrower, you have to have some evidence that your mortgage broker is working on your deal. And as a mortgage broker, you have to have evidence from whatever lender you're placing the deal with that they're actually working on your deal because everyone you know, can email and yes you to death, but it doesn't mean it's really happening. And then we're also work, you know, looking at um, different ways, very creative financing right can, now. Can, can I get back? Can I stay? Sure. I, cause it's an issue I think is important. Yes. One of the advantages they have with Gelt is we're a relatively small company. Yes. They're always going to speak to a decision maker. Mm -hmm. So you can make a decision, issue a term sheet. I can, yeah, Noah really can, Michael important. can. So at any one time here, we don't have a committee. No. You, you know, it's a very small group. We work as a team and you're always, and, and we're our own portfolio lenders. Right. We're not, uh, we, don't, we don't need the secondary market or the bond markets. We're not selling our no, loans. No, and that's what's like so wonderful. And that's why all the brokers really do enjoy. And it's a pleasure working with us because we do everything right here. You could talk to myself, Jack, exactly what Jack just said. There's always a decision to be made and we'll make it fast, you know, yeah. so there's so a lot no, more credibility than going yeah. with some of our competitors who have loan committees and you're it, talking. It's just too much. It's and, too much. And, and also, you know, I can get an answer to you. It may be yes or maybe no, but it's fast. It's very fast. And then you can move on with your day and, you know, take care of what you need to take okay. care of. I'm sorry to interrupt, so, but I want that. That was a good, no, it's a good selling point. Because we get tons of calls. How many times do we get a call on a Monday? Oh, I'll give you the deal, but you have to close Friday right. or Thursday. Every day, every week, every and day. another thing that has come up so much in conversation with me, with my brokers, is appraisals. Okay, so we have um, adopted the way of handling that because it's very hard to get appraisals out in the world ever getting since. getting your pictures there in the background. Ever, yes, yeah. my traveling. Um, it's very Marcy's hard to field. get appraisals done. And so we as a company had to see, what are we gonna do about this? You know, we can't have an appraisal hold up a deal six weeks, eight weeks, because they're so behind all their appraisers and it's just been so difficult. So we have taken it upon ourselves to create a team here that we will do an internal Gallup evaluation of the property which saves you money, which I'm saying thousands and thousands of dollars. How much do you think the actual, uh, the average appraisal on a mix use is now? 3,500 bucks? At least, I mean, it's gone up incredibly. And the time to get the appraisals back is unacceptable. What did it take, like five, six weeks? Yes. So most of so. the deals, I'm putting words in your mouth, we're doing, 99% of the deals we're doing are without appraisals, correct? And we do our own internal uh, evaluation yeah. and honestly, it's been working just yeah. fine. And so that gives us the speed that's needed to get our deals And it's deals a huge closed. savings to the borrower. Oh, thousands of dollars okay, in good. time. So, and every deal that we see is really is time sensitive. What else have you been working on like in the last 24 hours? Oh, 
all sorts of deals. I'm working on a car wash. Um, I did several presentations to different brokers offices, which is another thing. We're very open to do that. We will speak to your office and explain what we do and how we work deals. And if you have questions, we will take the time to explain our position and the market, you know, what we do for. So on that hours. one, to elaborate more, you were part of a sales meeting and I think they yes. had like 30 brokers or something. Yes, online and they're nationwide. And um, they're, they're definitely, uh, they're actually a merchant cash type of loan agency, but they need hard money loans because their their people are in situations and they need a place to place the hard money. So you educated the brokers on yes. how to do business. Okay, good. Yes, and, are you and I already received three deals from them. This I'm gonna try to talk about the stuff I want to talk about because that's the way it is. You know, I don't care about anything else. <laughs> I know you're working on a bunch of foreclosure bailout loans because yes. that's a huge product with us. Walk us through how yes. that works at Gelt. So if you've come across a borrower that's in pre-foreclosure or there's a sale date or whatever's going on with the property, we do foreclosure bailouts. And what that means is that we will pull them out of foreclosure and, and save the property in a sense. I mean, of course, there does have to be equity in the deal and um, it has to make sense. You know, whenever we do a foreclosure bailout, it has to make sense because we do want the borrower to be successful and also be able to make our payment to us once we do the loan for them. But we are very um, familiar with the process legally and um, you know, we do help them. And we also help people that are in bankruptcy or has just settled bankruptcy or, you know, are gonna declare bankruptcy, you know? So we've been able to, we know how to work with people involved in the court with that. And, um, you know, we help people, you know, there's been several properties that have been included in bankruptcy and we have satisfied that part of the puzzle and it helps them out and it releases the property. So we're very familiar with that also, Jack. Also during your, I'm trying to do a day in the life up. <laughs> yes. I know you worked on a borrower's request to up his loan amount. Yes. Tell us a little bit about that. Actually, anything that has to do with the borrowers, they, I'm like their contact person because I'm the first person and Jack is who they meet at Gelt Financial. So we, you know, we work with the borrowers, whatever they need. Um, if they need to have their loan longer, they can request a modification, which we will modify their lo loan and give them more time to get out of our loan. Or in this situation, I had a borrower come to me looking for more money. So that's another thing. He has the equity in the property and we were able to give him another additional funds and we modified so his we, loan. We, we originally lent him about 300000 about a year ago, yes. and now we approved him for another 200000 Exactly, now. and um, he's delighted, and uh, it works for him, and it works for us, because he was, you know, he's a good, um, a good borrower. Okay, I think we're trying to give everyone, now one more thing, you're yeah. also working on new loans. Every day I work in a new loans, I go from one email to the next, reviewing deals, I, I work, I'm on the phone, I discuss the deals with the broker. I have two deals I'm working on in Colorado. I have a deal I'm working on in Ohio. I have a deal I'm working on in Texas. Uh, I have it, it, it's just. You're forgetting New York. We have two deals we're closing. New York. New York. Yes, two New deals. York is actually our favorite state. Yeah, <laughs> we you, do a lot of business in New York. Two deals you're working on closing new, in New York soon. Yeah, a lot. Okay, lot, Marcy, so. is this a fair representation of a day in Gelt? Absolutely. It seems like, seems like you pack a lot more in. I work with you. Well, you can add, I, when I was on vacation a couple weeks ago, I think you see what goes on in the day in the life, in my life at this company. We're canceling so, all vacations. No more forward. vacations the rest of the year. Marcy, if someone wants to get in touch with you, how do they get in touch with you? You can email me at mberger, and it's B-E-R-G-E-R -E at gelt, G-E-L-T, financial.com. Or you can call me at 561-221-0900, extension 103. So. And don't forget, when your bank says no, we say yes. Yeah. Like the video, leave questions, Marcy will answer them. Yes. And remember, if you have a bank, uh, if you have a financing situation, give Marcy a call. Have a great day. I think that was